uh, as we know, there are around 14,000 people in Wales currently in temporary um, accommodation. Uh, and in evidence taken uh, through the Local Government and Housing Committee recently, councils and council leaders, whilst recognising funding is part of that challenge, as you've pointed out already, it's the lack of housing supply which they're finding particularly um, challenging uh, at the moment. And you mentioned the ambition to deliver those 20,000 uh, low-carbon uh, social homes, and, but there is uh, barriers uh, at the moment which um, developers uh, are facing to deliver on those homes. And one of those is around the, the, the phosphate uh, regulations. I have an example in my region, North Wales, where in, in the field uh, on the English side of the border, there's new social houses being built, and on the field on the Welsh side of the, builder, uh, of, of the border, those houses aren't able to be built because the phosphate regulations that are there. So people in Wales are not having the houses built that are required um, for them. Um, so I wonder, First Minister, what action will you be taking to accelerate uh, this ambition to deliver on those homes, rather than standing here again in two and three years' time talking about the homelessness challenge uh, that that faces? Uh, well, the phosphate issue is a genuine one, uh, Llawydd. Uh, I was able to meet the major players uh, in this area at the Royal Welsh Show earlier this year, and there's a follow-up meeting with all of those players planned for early in the new year, and that is to make sure that all those organisations that have a part to play in resolving the phosphates issue are able to do that, and that nobody spends their time pointing the finger at somebody else and saying, if only they did something, then this problem could be solved. Uh, now, the spirit at the meeting in Tranelwedd was much better uh, than that. I thought people did come genuinely looking to uh, advance the things that lay within their own responsibility. What the answer cannot be, Llawydd, is to allow house building to happen in places without a plan to make sure that that house building does not add to the already excessive levels of pollution in rivers in Wales. Uh, the pollution crisis that we face in some parts of Wales is absolutely real, and we can't make that worse in order to make something else better. But we know that if every organisation makes its contribution, it is possible to go on developing new houses on land that otherwise would not be available for that purpose. But it does depend, as I say, on c collecting together all those different contributions and unlocking uh, the current barriers that exist to developments that we would like to see go ahead. 